Hello, this is Vettel121, and happy 4th of July on Let's Play Dragon Quest V. Of course, there's some of you that probably don't live in the States or are from the States that probably don't give a shit about the 4th of July, but, you know, whatever. Uh... For those of you that don't give a shit about 4th of July, uh, happy Christmas in July, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, we have to use the, uh, torch there to, uh... Get rid of the ghosts, I guess. Um, ooh, he looks scary. Okay, all right, we've already been in there, so ooh, yeah, he definitely looks scary. Look, well, actually, he looks like he's cracked out. You kids did a, v you kids did very well to get this far. Won't you help us find some delicious ingredients for tonight's feast? Come closer. Uh, no. Uh. And was I supposed to say no there? Okay, it's a butt thou must situation, apparently. Oh, the ingredient is us. Oh, okay. And the hell? <laughs> nice. Uh, apparently, ch yeah, apparently children are the main course. Whoa. You want me to take this hell sight to your neck? Well, isn't he dead? Wait a minute, you're threatening a ghost? Are you kidding me? Wow, they're throwing salt on us. <laughs> wow. Uh, okay. Sure. Whatever, man. <laughs> I just think it's hilarious that that skeleton there was threatening a ghost with a scythe. Why should the ghost care if he's dead? Okay then. Well, Mr. Skeletons. Wow, this looks delicious. Wait a minute, who's, who's cheering right now? Wow. Okay then, well, let's take out some demon candles. Okay, any more? Any more? I mean, the hell, man. Oh, wait, we're done. Okay then, I guess we're gonna go back up to the, uh, to the, to the friggin' top floor then. But yeah, that's the wrong way, apparently. Oh, come on, man. They're gonna make us walk all the way back up there again? Here I was thinking we were just gonna fight the boss right away. You know. Okay. Oh, what the hell, man? Seriously, with the encounter rate? Just trying to get somewhere already. Ooh, what did they drop? Okay, they dropped a bronze knife. I don't know if that sucks or not, but I guess I could sell it, maybe. Okay. Jeez, it's a long ass walk all the way up to the top. Especially if we get keep getting bothered by freaking drackies. And demon candles. Goodbye, drackies. Uh, what do you have to say, Bianca? Let's go get them. I can't let them continue on any longer. Uh, okay. 
Yeah, let's get them, man. They try to try to make us into food. It's not good. Where are you going, man? What the hell? All right, I guess we gotta chase them outside then. You again? It looks like you've been munched on by skeletons. Well, this time I'll have you all for myself. Okay then, I guess it's boss time against the Ghost Master. Alright, uh, well, I guess I'm just going to buff my party. I, I guess I'll buff myself first. And, yeah, okay, we got some different spells here. We got Dazzle, which throws illusions at a group of enemies. Sad, or Sizz, a fireball that engulfs a group of foes. And stuff like that. Okay, lowers the defense. I'll use Kasap on this guy, I guess. Ow. Yeah, I'll, I guess I'll use Buff one more time. This time I'll use it on Bianca. A little... A little more Kazap here. Yeah, keep lowering his defense. That should help out. I guess I'll just attack and have Bianca cast freaking spells on this bastard. I don't know how much HP this guy has, obviously. Uh, yeah, I think we're I think we're still good, actually. Ooh, ow, that hurt a little bit. Um, hmm, yeah, I'll heal Bianca, have her cast Kasap again, okay, he's not affected, so that must mean his defense is reduced to, I guess, as low as it can get, so yeah, let's keep attacking this guy, I guess, ow, ow, okay, I don't think we're in trouble just yet, Actually, physical attack does more damage than that freaking spell, it looks like. Alright, we defeated the Ghost Master. Yay! And somebody gained a level. Outstanding. And Bianca's on level 11? Jeez. She's like two levels ahead of me. It's crazy. Spare me, please! I want to leave this castle! If you let us leave, then our kind will never bother this castle again. As Demon World outcasts, we just wanted a place where we could have a good time. Please forgive us, please, please. Uh, oh shit! What happens? What happens if I? Uh, no, I'm not gonna forgive you. Okay, fine, we'll forgive you. I'm just gonna say no to everything to find out if it's a butt down must situation in this game. <laughs> Because really, I have no idea. Okay, the king and queen are... What, are they going to come back to life now? You did an outstanding job. I thank you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you so much. Because of your help, we can finally rest in peace. Looks like the castle's other residents can sleep well, too. Well, shall we take our leave, my love? Yes, my darling. Farewell. I'll never forget the bravery you children showed me. Okay, that's great, isn't it? Those two will live on forever in happiness from now on. But still, I can't forgive all those ghosts who took over this castle. Definitely not forgiving them for attacking all those innocent people. Huh? I wonder what this is. Oh, what a pretty jewel. It's got to be a reward for all our hard work. Hey, let's take it with us. And Bianca handed the glowing gold-colored orb to vet. Okay, we have a gold orb in our bag now. Okay, then. Uh, well, I'm, I, I, I guess we can't get attacked in this castle anymore, right? Because the ghosts are gone, supposedly. Can we get out this way, or is it close? Okay, we can get out this way. Uh, outstanding. I like the music playing here. It's pretty nice. All 
right. Well, I guess that's it. That's all there is to do with this castle, I, I guess. So, uh, I guess we'll be heading back to town. All right, we're back at El Capa. So, let's, uh, oh. The news that Vet defeated the monsters of Lunul Castle spread that very night. And then the sun rose. Da -da -da, yay. You promised, just like you said before, we get the kitty. Hey, what are you doing? Because I have no choice. Okay, I promised. And you guys did great. I'll give you this cat. Oh, okay, cool. How about that, Mr. Cat? Nobody will tease you anymore. Hey, hurry up. Let's get going. Uh, oh, okay. So we now have a cat in our party. Or something like that. Whoa. That's right. Let's give Mr. Cat a name. Hmm? How's Barongo sound to you? Uh, no. Uh, Rusty? No. Andre? No, that's the worst one yet. Fluffy? No. Lynx? No. Crowley? Uh, uh, no. Peach? Definitely not. Zoro? Zoro. No. Porch? Hell no. We're not watching Doug. Buster? No. How many names? Oh, okay, so that that's the extent of the names we can choose. Okay. Actually, let's go with Rusty. Why not? Yeah, why not? Yes, we have a new... Boom! I love the front theme. <laughs> Okay, Rusty has joined the party. Cool, man. We have another party member, I, I I think. Well, he doesn't show up there on the frickin'... How come he's not in my menu? What's going on there? Yeah, the weeping noise stopped. Yeah, I don't know how the frickin' word spread so fast. I mean... You know, I, I guess it's that RPG rule again, where if you uh, if you do something, it's gonna automatically uh, the news of it is uh, is gonna automatically reach people faster than you can actually get there. So are you gonna unlock the door for us so we can get? Oh, okay, I guess not. I just want to explore the rest of the bar, but it's not. You know, they're not letting me. I wonder. I wonder how we get in there. Oh well. Whatever. Alright, well anyway, let's talk to, uh... Let's talk to these people. Let's talk to Duncan here. Looks like Duncan's doing better. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I guess we weren't supposed to do that. Sorry to have worried you. Papa's cold is all better now, Vet. We should head back to the village. Have you said your goodbyes to everyone? Uh, no, not yet. I guess we'll go around and say goodbye then, or something, I guess, I don't know. What, we just saved the area from a whole bunch of ghosts. By the way, now you know that old guard always falls asleep at his post. We, we just saved the land from the hordes of darkness, and you're still not going to let us leave during the day by ourselves? What the hell, man? Yeah, we do have some balls, although Bianca probably doesn't have balls, but, you know, whatever. If you want to talk in literal terms. Oh, they gave that kitten to you? Phew, thank you. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah, I think I'm just going to end the episode right here, actually. And, uh, we will set out back to our our village in the next episode of Let's Play Dragon Quest V. This is Vat0121, and I'll see you next time. Yeah, give me hints and tips, of course, if you want to.